it's Bunny and today is finally that big giveaway that I told you guys about in my last tea vlog. I know it was supposed to be up yesterday but I'm still on the road to recovery and today I'm finally starting to actually feel like I might be alive or that I'm gonna make it through this horrible cold infectious nastiness going on in my facial area. So I've been doing a lot of sassy slumbering this week in preparation to rise from the ashes like the phoenix and I rose with Elvis hair. It's got that kind of flip. Uh -huh. Do you see it? Do you see it? Elvis. This giveaway I have literally been planning for you guys for a month and a half. It's kind of a big deal. It's kind of like a huge giveaway and it's going to be two winners this time of the exact same really big, really awesome prize. So if you guys have been on my channel any amount of time, you know that pretty much my favorite makeup brand and the makeup brand that I'm using all the time is Tarte. It's got all of my staples things that I'm crazy about, things I can't leave the house without, yada yada yada. So alongside with Tarte, they let me customize two gift sets and the two gift sets are going to have the exact same product two times over of my all-time favorite staple products. So each kit that I've put together is $240 worth of makeup. You could pretty much do your entire face, your whole makeup routine. With this makeup, you wouldn't really need too much else except for maybe like a tube of mascara and foundation if you wear that sort of thing. I've kind of been skipping the foundation lately so this kit is kind of tailored more to my most recent makeup routine. So I got to customize and pick out every aspect of these little kits, actually kind of like big kits, and I even got to pick out the case that they're in. It's kind of like a bag. You could almost carry this as a purse, but I picked this out too. It is kind of like an old looking oil painting. I love things like that. And there's actually like a strap for the bag on the inside, so you can turn it into like a little backpack bag or elongate the straps and carry it like a shoulder bag, kind of like a messenger bag style. So it's like super functional if you want to carry it as a purse or travel makeup thing, whatever you want. It'll be yours if you win it. You can do whatever you want with it. Now I'm going to show you guys the products that I've put in here. And a lot of these products have been, like I said, in my favorites videos or tutorials that I've done. Let the show begin. So the very first product, which is one of my all-time favorite kind of facial prep and prime products, is the Tarte Maracuja Lip Exfoliant. First of all, I absolutely love the packaging. Like I always say, I am a sucker for pretty packaging and this really has a nice natural boho vibe. It's in a tin so it's really good you know for putting in your purse or whatever. I cannot open it. Phalanges cooperate. It has a very very pepperminty kind of smell to it. I absolutely love lip products with a pepperminty kind of aspect because you know your lips are for kissing so it's like good to always smell minty or use like minty flavor smell and lip products in my opinion. And I love the fact that it's like a gentle exfoliant. It's not really coarse or rough so it's just good. I use it in the mornings and at night just to kind of like keep my lips from being dry and gross. The very next thing that you're going to get is Tarte Maracuja CI Brightener and it's honestly one of the best eye treatment things that I have ever tried. It is really good for reducing puffiness and bags and dark circles circles and all those things that you don't want on your face. It has a creamy kind of texture, but it's not heavy, if that makes any sense. I put this on every single day before I start to put on my, you know, tinted moisturizers and powders and basically the rest of my makeup. So this is like step one for me. The next product is a product that I use every single day. I've talked about this a million times. It's in like every single one of my makeup tutorials and it is the Park Avenue Princess Bronzer. So packaging, lovely, lovely. It's a square and it's got kind of this like 
alligator skin texture, which is a total bonus Jonas. This is the shade of it. I feel like it could really complement a lot of different skin tones and depending on how you apply it, it can give you a really dramatic look or a really natural look. I love everything about it. It lasts all day. It is my most favorite bronzer of all time. I've been using it for over a year now and it's basically the only bronzer I ever use. The next thing that you're going to get is one of my most recent favorites. It is the Tarte Smolderize Amazonian Clay Waterproof Liner and I chose the shade Golden Black and I'm actually wearing that right now like on the outer. These little like um what are the like semicircles that I've got going on in my eyes. It really is basically a black color with subtle golden flecks in it, but these are so creamy. They are so blendable. So you can go once again for like a more dramatic look with like a thicker, darker, not so blended line, or you can just, you know, very thinly put it on and blend it out with the spongy side and go for a really natural look. So not only did I want to give you guys like a thicker eyeliner, I wanted to give you one of the thinner eyeliners. So I picked one in my absolute favorite shade, which is Sunstone bronze and once again it's got the pencil side and it's got the sponge side. This is also incredibly easy to blend out so same thing that I said about the last one you can really create like a smoldery look or I guess that's why it's called smolder eyes. Next thing that I wanted to include for you guys is one of the Amazonian waterproof cream eyeshadow colors and this is in shimmering bronze and I always kind of thought I I was not a big fan of cream shadows, but the more that I play with them, the more that I really like them. I think that they just take some practice, but the more that I've been wearing cream shadows and not so much powdery shadows, especially as it starts to get more humid here. I live in Texas, so I gotta think about humidity a lot. But the more that I've been wearing these in humid climates, the better that they kind of stay on and stay in place than powder shadows. I don't know if everybody has that experience or I don't know if it's just been happening for me lately but I've really been digging it. This is what it looks like and I love this shade. I've tried three of the shades. I think that there's four or five in total and I've tried three out of the five and this shimmering bronze color is my absolute favorite. I think it's perfect for summer to kind of give you that glowy, bronzy, healthy look. I'm really all about the browns and the bronzes and the more neutral shadow shades lately so that's why I picked that one. The next product that I'm going to give you guys is a product that's only been on the market for I think like three or four months. Well, this shade has only been on the market for three or four months. When I saw this at Sephora, I just freaked out and totally I'm really into stuff like this. I love this product. I love the packaging. I love the way that it makes me feel like sometimes it's just like the feeling that makeup gives you. At least that's what does it for me. It's like a whole like mindset thing. This is one of Tarte's infamous cheek stains and I feel like the very first time that I saw Tarte anywhere in a magazine it was for these cheek stains and people were absolutely raving about them. They're so easy to carry around. This one is in the shade Awakening and it has a lot of natural type berries in it and I will tell you the names of a few slash slaughter the names of a few because we all know I can't pronunciate nothing. So it's got the Achai berry and the Goji berry and the Maracuja extract and it's also got some pomegranates, pomegranates, pomegranates. Suddenly, I can't spreak. Spreak. See? Just prove my point. It really has like a really kind of, I, like this is a stupid way to describe it, but a very like juicy, refreshing, berry kind of smell to it. I love everything about it. It's totally perfect if you just want to have like a little bit of a blushy glow and you don't even really want to worry about any other makeup. It's really easy to just like wipe this on. It's kind of in like a deodorant stick form. So they released another product at the same time they released this one with similar packaging and it's one of the Lip Surgeons 
pencil lip balm type things. I don't know. This one is really like a lip balm one in my opinion. It's called Energy and once again it just has absolutely beautiful packaging and I'm not exactly sure if this one is supposed to be tinted but at least on my lips it's not really tinted looking at all. It goes on really clear or the shade of my lips. Once again all their lip products have a really amazing peppermint extract quality to them. It's not overpowering but it's just really nice and refreshing and I have this one. I have another one of all these so that's why this one's the brand new one but um, I keep this in my purse all the time once again anytime I get dry lips or anything like that I can just sweep this on and it's super refreshing and super moisturizing and I just love the aesthetic of it it's so gorgeous and the last thing that's in here is my all-time absolute favorite Tarte product and probably my all-time absolute favorite makeup product out of all the makeup products that I own I am a complete sucker for a red lip. Literally, if I couldn't put anything else on my face for the rest of my life, and the only thing I could have is like one thing, I would choose to have a red lip. And I really think a lot of people are afraid to try it or they think it looks clownish or stupid or whatever, but I swear, just try it. Just try it one time. You will feel so sassy. You will feel so fierce. There's just nothing more empowering to me makeup wise than a red lip. So this is my all-time favorite red lip product. It's my staple. I could not rave anymore about this. I give this to friends. I give this to family. Um, it is the Tarte Lip Surgeon's Natural Matte Lip Tint in the shade Fiery. I love matte lip products. I love matte so much more than glossy or creamy or anything like that. Matte always lasts so much longer in my opinion. This literally lasts through everything like drinking through straws, eating food, like wiping your mouth. I mean well you can't like full-on wipe but like if you just like blot your lipstick when you're out to eat like a lady uh, it doesn't come off. When you're kissing your boyfriend, it doesn't come off. This thing is just so magical. Uh, so this is the shade that I chose because I just, I want to give the whole world the gift of the red lip. I think it's something that everybody should try at least like once, even if you go out and get like a 99 cent lipstick that's just bright, bloody red. Just try it. Don't knock it till you try it. Uh, so that is it. Those are all the products that you will win. So there are a few things that are a little bit different about this giveaway than the other giveaways that I normally do. The first thing being where you're going to enter and Tarte set up this absolutely beautiful, wonderful uh, system for this contest. So you're going to click on that and then you just input your information and easy peasy one, two, three, Z, you're entered in the contest. You don't have to tweet about it or anything else. It would be nice if you did so everyone can enter. Uh, but that's all you got to do. You just have to put your information in there. They're going to be selecting two winners at random. You have to be subscribed to my channel because it's my giveaway with Tarte. It's just you know, it's the nice thing to do. Uh, and then go enter on Tarte. So the other rules are is that you have to be 18 or older or have your parents permission. Please guys, this is such an important step because my last couple giveaways, I was having to pick alternate winners because their parents wouldn't let them have the prize or their parents didn't want them to have makeup or yada, yada, yada. So let's just make this process easy for everybody and just make sure that it's okay if you need to have permission for you to have permission to enter. And then the other thing that is kind of a bummer that uh, like if I could change this one thing I would but it's not within my power. Um, Tarte is a US based company and they don't ship internationally. They don't sell internationally so unfortunately they're not going to ship this prize internationally either. 
So this contest, you have to either have a US address or you have to live in the United States. I'm sorry, but all of my other contests are always open internationally, worldwide. So this is like the first one that I've had in a super long time that is US only. That's just the way that this cookie crumbled. So I'm so, so sorry. Please don't hate me for that. That's just how this one went. Other than that, everything else is pretty standard. The giveaway is going to be up for a week, so hopefully that gives everybody a chance to enter that wants to enter. And stay tuned because next week I'm going to have another super big giveaway and that's gonna be open to everybody international, worldwide. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope y'all enjoy this. I hope you're all doing great and that if you caught this crud that's going around that you're recovering quickly, quite nicely. Uh, so I will see you guys tomorrow. I hope, granted, that I continue to feel better. Uh, so I love you guys so much. Take care of yourselves. Please enter down below. Take a minute to subscribe if you're not already subscribed so that you're eligible for the contest. So I will see you guys tomorrow. Love y'all. Bye.